G'day guys, Jeff Ware here from bikereview.com.au. I'm at Phillip Island on a cold autumn day. Track's a bit slick, but look what I'm on. The all new, much anticipated Honda Fireblade, the 2017 standard model. It's got a great electronics package, so we're using that well and truly today. So I've done about six sessions today, six or seven sessions. I've been going, doing an out lap, two or three laps and coming in and trying every different setting possible on the bike. So this morning the track was really dirty and cold and we're on street sports tyres, no tyre warmers, stuff like that. So it was really good. I actually tried the rain mode, which is mode three, um, and then went to mode two, then mode one. And I've actually gone back to mode two for a while. And you know, the bike is unbelievably well controlled with these electronics. It's a long time coming for the Fireblade, obviously. Um, but with the IMU um, and all the current technology on board this bike, it really has modernised it. First real impressions on the bike, it's tiny, it's a lot smaller than the old bike, a lot more compact in every way, um, you know, changes direction quickly, handling's really, really good, it's got the ABS, new, old new ABS system, uh, rear wheel lift control, which isn't switchable unfortunately for the track, but it's still a really good feature to have. The engine is more powerful, uh, it's peak here, it revs to 13,000 RPM now and top speed is I've been getting is 290, around 290 kilometres an hour at the end of the straight, which is pretty impressive. Uh, don't forget that is a road speedo reading, but that's still impressive for a 1,000cc bike. I'm a tall guy. It is a compact bike. Once in the corner, though, I find it quite comfortable and ergonomically really nice for cornering. Um, the screen's a bit low for me, so I'd probably put a taller screen on it, obviously, being a bigger guy. And a few little things like that, I'd put resets on it and lower the pegs a bit and just customise it for myself like everyone does with a motorcycle anyway. But the overall bones of it, unbelievable. Huge leap forward. Feels like a CBR 600 really, um, with mega power. So great job by Honda. Styling's fantastic, everything's brand new. And the most surprising and uh, thing that's made me the happiest is the exhaust note. You can hear now. Listen how loud that bike is for a standard bike. titanium system, really good crisp note um, and the best thing about it too, it hasn't lost that fire blade feel, it still feels like a fire blade so fans like me, I mean my road bike's a 95 tiger stripe blade, people like me are going to still love this bike and identify with it. Anyway for the full review visit bikereview.com.au, don't forget to subscribe to this channel and thanks for watching, I hope you have a fantastic day. Okay, awesome.